What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another draw preview, and the clay court season continues for the WTA, the WTA 500 event in Stuttgart this week, and there are some big names that are playing, but some big names are pulled out, so let's go to the withdrawals. All right, so a couple of big names here. We have Victoria Azarenka. She's pulled out. Burton's is out. Conta. Rybakina. And the French Open champions, Fiontech, is also out of this event. All right, starting at the top of the draw, we have eight seeds in this event, and the top four seeds get a bye in the first round. The world number one, Ash Barty. She gets a bye in the first round. She'll play the winner of Sigamund or Barthel in the second round. Then we have Ostapenko versus the qualifier Vodul. Winner of that's going to play either lucky loser Korpash or the number six seed Karolina Pliskova. And Pliskova hasn't had the greatest starts to 2021, so maybe the clay court season is where she can turn it around. Then we have the number four seed Spedalina. She gets a buy in the first round. She'll take on the winner of Kerber or the lucky loser Gorgodes in the second round. Then we have Sakari versus Petkovic. Winner of that's going to play either Brady or the number seven seed Kvitova. And that is a huge... Huge first round match between Kvitova and the Australian Open finalist, Brady. It just shows how big this event is. The fact that players like Sakari, Brady are unseated in this one. Players to watch out for. Obviously, we've got to watch out for Ash Barty. She's a French Open champion back in 2019. And also Ostapenko as well, former French Open champion. But I'm keen to see how Sakari and Brady do because they're in the top 20, yet they're unseated in this event. Second half of the draw now, we have the number five seed, Sabalenka. She versus Zhang in the first round. Winner of that's going to play a qualifier in the second round, either Akiri or Freedsom, who both came through qualifying. Then we have another qualifier, Middendorf, up against Kontovit. Winner of that's going to take on number three seed, Sophia Kennan, and the reigning finalist from the French Open of 2020. Remember that as well. Looking to get some form back, Kennan. Then we have the number eight seed, Benchit. She takes on qualifier, Shunk, in the first round. Winner of that's going to take on either Alexandrova or Makova in the second round. Then we have Buskova versus Vondrasova. Winner of that's going to take on number two seed, Simona Halep. So we've got Halep. She's back. We haven't seen Halep since the Australian Open. She was supposed to play in a couple of tournaments over the Middle East and hardcourt season. Dubai, Doha, didn't play those events and didn't play Miami. So first time we're seeing Simona. Let's see how she does. But some names to watch out for. Got to watch out for Kennan and obviously Halep as well. But also keep an eye out for Vondrasova. Remember, she made the French Open final back in 2019. So she's going to be dangerous in this event. And she could set up a second round matchup with Halep, which would be an absolute blockbuster for the second round of this event. All right, so there it is. The Stuttgart Open. It is an absolute stacked event. Some of the players that are unseated in this event are crazy. Some top 20 players like Sakari, Brady, not being seated. Absolutely crazy. That just shows how big this event is. Let me know down in the comments below. Who do you have winning this event? It's still very early in the clay court season, so no one's really got much form on the clay. So it's going to be tough to pick. All right, so having a look at the draw now, and I'll tell you what, it is very tough to pick. But I'm going to go with Sophia Kennan. I reckon she's going to return things around. Hasn't had the greatest start to 2021. A lot of pressure on her, of course, being the Australian Open champion, having to try and defend that title. And of course, she made the French Open final last year. So I'm going to go with Kennan to get through and win this one. Again, let me know down in the comments below, who do you think is going to win this one? So the WTA clay court season continues with an absolutely stacked event in Stuttgart.